Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. Coming up with the release of the HTC Touch Diamond 2 and Touch Pro 2, HTC will release a lot of new bits of software, um, such as the landscape, TouchFlow 3D, and the, uh, the new calendar, and a lot of other things to be on the new devices. Now, we spent about eight minutes in a video in our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash pocketnowvideo, and I'll post a link on the video right now so you can go back and look at that. But this newest ROM uh, from XD Developers brings even more features from the upcoming Touch Pro 2 and Touch Diamond 2 that I wanted to show you in this video. For example, the Start menu has been changed. So if I press on the Start button, I am now taken to the HTC Program Launcher instead of the ugly Windows Mobile um, I, you know, iconic interface. And it's got very smooth flick scrolling and we can add our own programs. And you're probably wondering what happened to the regular start menu. Well, you really can't get to it. Though if you want to go to all programs, you press on this button here and we're taken to a very finger friendly list of all of the programs. Although this takes a little bit of getting used to because if there's a program at the bottom of the page, that you want to get to, um, you have to flick all the way to the bottom. But uh, fortunately, you can assign your favorite programs here so that you don't have to do that. So we could, you know, click Add there. And we could flick all the way to the bottom and add this item here. And there it is. Now, what about settings? Well, if you press settings here, it doesn't actually take you to the settings menu that you're used to. To get to that settings, we have to, or let me go back here. We have to go to all settings, and then we're taken to the standard Windows Mobile setting interface. I think that's an, a step too many, and I wish that there could be a link directly to the settings menu, uh, the main settings menu from the screen, but I haven't found a way to do that yet. Another change comes in the Internet tab. So if we go over to the center here, and by the way, these I'm going to flip this to Landscape. Uh, by the way, the new version of TouchFlow 3D will have push internet, so it will, it will pre-cache pages so that you can access them quickly without having them to load. Meaning if there's a site you check every day at 3 o'clock, you can have it reload itself every day at 3 o'clock so it's ready there for you. Uh, again, we talked about this on that 8 minute, minute video that I talked about earlier. Now what you can do here is you can enter in a Google search right from the screen. So if we search for um, you know, HTC Touch Pro, and we click search. It will launch Opera Mobile quite quickly, actually, and take you to the Google results page. And from here, you can, uh, you know, look on the internet. And that's it for the tour of the new ROM that comes from the HTC Touch Pro 2 and Touch Diamond 2. Again, I encourage you to check out that eight-minute video that goes through a lot of the changes uh, to the new TouchFlow 3D, such as the more advanced contacts tab and the Facebook integration. There's a lot of good stuff there. So we'll be back with more later. That's it for now.